Well, Tim, the Clackamas County District Attorney's Office now taking the lead on this. They say the shooting happened after officers pulled someone over with a suspended license. Now, two uh, officers are on paid leave and the driver in the hospital with critical injuries. An early morning shooting outside the Taco Bell in Milwaukee, just off Highway 224. I got kind of scared at first. Brian Bike was working inside the Sherry's restaurant across the parking lot. I was walking past the window and then as soon as I walked past the window, I seen I heard about like four or five shots. This all happening before 1 a.m. The Clackamas County District Attorney's Office says two Milwaukee police officers fired their weapon during a traffic stop for a suspended license. The man inside the car was shot and taken to the hospital with critical injuries. A witness outside the Taco Bell shared this video with KGW, showing officers trying to communicate with the man multiple times inside the car. Hands out the window now. Throughout the nearly 24 minute long video, you hear officers giving him commands on what to do with his hands. It's unclear if he ever responds or does what they're asking. Listen, dude, put your hands out the window so we can help you. We don't know when in the sequence of events this video takes place, you also hear officers warn him about force being used. And you can hear and see some sort of projectile being fired at the car. Oh yeah, 40, 40, 40. 40 is a term used by police warning that non-lethal munitions are being fired. I never experienced anything like that so close. It was kind of, um, it's kind of exhilarating, kind of scary. The video ends before officers approach the car the DA's office says officers gave the man first aid before he was taken to the hospital. No officers were injured. We're still waiting to learn the names of those two officers that are now on paid leave, as well as the man injured in the shooting. Back to you. All right, Devin, thanks for that report.